had many battles with uh, Gunther, Walter in, in Europe, and I know you've spoken uh, a lot about these matches, but one thing I was very curious about, you know, wrestling him for almost a decade now, he has changed a lot. And specifically, he's spoken about his, his body transformation, and we've, we've seen it, those of us who have followed his career. What's the difference in wrestling him when he was a, a bigger man and, you know, bigger in stature and then kind of losing weight going on the diet and everything and now that he's a little bit smaller like is there a difference in wrestling him as far as just his overall style oh absolutely not i mean like i assume definitely he, he is in the shape of his life i mean like as a performer you always need to continue to work and this is mm, there's so many areas where you can work on i mean like just be uh, just having ring skills is by far, not everything that you need to put work in. You need to put work in your training. You need to put work in your health. You need to put work in how you talk, how you dress, how you carry yourself. This is, there's such a big, so many different dimensions that you need to need to work on to be a complete performer, to be a complete artist. And in his regards, I mean, like, I have nothing left for him that just a huge amount of respect because he is one of a kind. And you can see that his absolutely outstanding mentality just transfers to everything he does. And this is just amazing to see. That's that's the bar I set for myself, too. Did he hit harder back, back in the day, or does he hit harder now? He hits hard always. <laughs> he's, the, he is the, he's the person who hits me the hardest and pushed me the hardest and taught me the most and uh there's not no not enough flowers that you can raise it with i i know you mentioned that you wanted to to face him at wrestlemania uh as a, as a possibility you said you you guys are kind of destined to sort of fight forever you and walter at, or gunther at wrestlemania for the intercontinental title do you think that match could happen as early as mania 40 <laughs> i don't i don't know about it like i mean like this is a, just like a like, let's say it's, it's a dream. It's a, I don't plan, I can't see it. Like, um, I'm not sure how fast it's going to happen. But I, th I just have the feeling that this, that would be the right thing to do because they're just like the two perfect opposites. Like, he is like, uh, he's like the final boss. Everybody sees that. Everybody feels that. And I'm the ultimate underdog. I'm a one of a dying breed. Like, one of those guys who can, who you can punch and, hit and slam as much as you want to you just don't keep me down and i think i delivered a bunch enough examples to really believe that and how can these both things how they cannot work out and how they cannot attract the entire attention of the audience